When you come into the land which the Lord your God gives you for an inheritance, can you just imagine what Israel must have felt finally hearing those words? <laughs> Wandering around in the wilderness for 40 years, and now they get to, to hear the words when you come into the land. And I love what God does here as you read through this, this uh, passage in Deuteronomy 26. God tells them, when you come to the land, here's what I want you to do. I want you to grab some of the fruit of the land. The amazing fruit that you saw when you sent the spies over and they brought them back. Grapes the size of soccer balls and, and all this amazing fruit. God says, I want you to gather a bunch of that and I want you to come together and I want you to hold a worship celebration. I want you to offer the first, the first fruits of the land to me. And then I want you to sit down and I want you to eat. And a little bit further into the chapter, again, God says, here's what I want you to do. I want you to gather the foods together in the third year when you're there. And I want you to bring all the tithe and all these fruits and these foods together. And I want you to eat and I want you to worship. I want you to celebrate and I want you to be joyful. There's one more aspect of it that's encouraging for us, though. God says, as you come together and you are enjoying the fruits of the land, I want you to remember the hard times that I have brought you through. Not the hard times that you had to go through by yourself, not the difficult times that, that you had to figure out a way to get through in order to, to reach me here in the promised land. No, no, I was with you every step of the way, through every trial, through every difficulty, and now that you are here, I want you to remember that I was with you all the way and that we are now celebrating together, being together in the promised land. Today, I wanna to invite you in your trials and your troubles, remember that God is with you, bringing you through to the other side so that he can celebrate with you as you celebrate his deliverance and victory in your life.